If you wanted to become a war thing, that's no problem with me. Raymond Romanov, you want to go to war? Hey, it's me, Benji. I'm so sorry, Mr. B. Kwaiba. Kwaiba is being hard headed right now and arguing with Ray right now. So we should be meeting in less than five minutes. Okay, there you go. Yeah, what's up, Raymond? Hey, Benji. Sorry about the delay on the phone call. I was dealing with some family issues. No, I got you. I got you. Okay, so. Some fucking stupid shit that was caused over uh, an ocean dumping. Anyway. I got you, man. So, are you free to talk right now? Where are you guys at? I am free. I've, I've heard some things. I'm down to talk. What are you guys at? Uh, well, where are you? I'm just driving around uh, right now. Literally doing the same. We just we just had the meeting with the uh, with Gigi. Uh, where 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 do you where do you guys want to meet? We could just meet the uh, man or something. We can meet at the man. We can meet at the the arena next to the manor, man. Let's go there. The arena next you know, to the manor. Let's just meet the, the manor. It's fine. Okay, fine. I'll be here. Bye, right, Benji. See you there. Right, bye, bye. Yo, yo, what's up, everyone? Uh, what's up, Benji? Benji? Looking good, man. I like your suit. You too, you too. So, what happened to Ash? She, uh, you know, she was uh, involved with some serial killer bullshit. What the fuck? All right, let's talk inside, guys. This fountain is going to be loud. If we, if we do here. All right, make sure everyone is speaking very loudly when you yeah. sit here. And take a seat, guys. But that's that's the next meeting, KJ. <laughs> what? That's the meeting after this. Or oh, the what you being in the wheelchair thing? Yes. Get back, get back, get back. All right. <laughs> Ash, come here, come closer, so you can uh, talk here. Yeah, yeah make sure Ash, you guys here. are yelling. I'll, I'll okay. go on the other side, Ash, and you can sit right there. Okay, okay but, but I, I'm confused. So this is the uh, this is a problem that I'm having right now, Ray, and hopefully you can help me clear this up. Okay. Okay. What is this, my so friend? So I got news from uh, one of my boys, JJ. That, uh, you know, he did a job with Speedy and uh, X and uh, things going a little bit fucking south. Okay. So they tried to cheat oh, him out X. of, uh, exactly. Yeah. He tried to, they tried to cheat him out of his money and everything. And uh, JJ, unfortunately, didn't end up getting paid. You know, they gave okay. something at the end, but, uh, you know, it was a little bit fucked up. But uh, anyway. So is this in reference to, I'm assuming X then, because he, he might do that type of thing. No, no, yeah, no, this is more in reference to Speedy, man. It's more in reference to Speedy. Oh, okay. and apparently, there was a hit put out on my boy. His name is JJ Joaquin Jimenez. I know JJ. I've done jobs he, with him. Oh, you've done jobs with JJ? The, uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. JJ. Yeah. Video, like two weeks ago? Yeah, so the, the problem with the whole situation is that um, apparently a 150K hit was put out on JJ. And we're trying to figure out who it was that ended up trying to hunt for him. So you're and saying a group of people hunted for him? Yes, uh, that's what I'm saying. But my problem right now is that a lot of people are telling me that it was uh, somebody that I thought was my friend. You know what Wait, I mean? They're saying it was us? Or who? Me specifically? You specifically, right? You think it was me? You think I would take a 150k hit for, for what? For JJ? Exactly. I think uh, that's what that's... That's as ridiculously, uh, you know, how I took it, you know? But why would they cause conflict with you guys for money? It doesn't make any sense. I've been friends with you for a long time now. And more importantly, mm. what makes you guys think it was me? I think uh, this is where Ash can uh, give some insight into this. I uh, I was there, like, uh, when the whole thing was going down, right? Uh, yes. And I was rolling on over to the cafe, and I see this guy on a motorbike. Like up in construction, I go over him and I say hi, and he won't talk to me, and he just yeets out of there. And I'm like, oh, okay, that was weird. But then I find out about the hit. So then I'm chilling, I'm watching the, the you know, the black Porsche and the Subaru and the motorbike circle around the cafe, go up construction, go over onto the highway, sit there for a while, circle around and around and around and around, around. And then eventually the, uh, the Subaru, it, uh, it actually stopped at LSBN. And so I went over there, I went over there with Gabriel, and I was reading the number plate to see who it belonged to. I think it was a fake plate on it. And, uh, anyway, while we were there, this fellow comes out, dressed in uh, all black, with a stupid looking fucking backpack. And he points his gun at us, his AK, he points it at us, right at our faces. 
I say, oh, hey, you know how's gone? And Gabe says, okay. And then as soon as I spoke, he puts down the gun, gets in his car, he drives off, and he goes beep beep on the way out. Wait, hey, so you're saying the there was a hit put out, and people dressed in all black wouldn't say anything for you or to you whatsoever. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is not the end hey. of the story. So anyway, they get in the car, drive off, beep beep, and I'm like, what the heck? That was kind of weird. They wouldn't talk to me, but they still beep beep the horn. As soon as they saw it was me, they put their gun down. Okay, that's interesting. That must mean we know them. When they know us, they're our friends. And they don't want to be found out. Or so that could potentially, just, just for reference, that could be it. also that they probably found that you weren't the target they were looking for and they don't want to shoot you in the head. You speaking from experience or what? You were going to let no, me finish No, I'm the assuming story. what they're fucking is probably thinking. If they see you, they honk at you and they just drive away. You're saying they put the hood out for who? JJ or who is it, Benji? You? It's for JJ. So why the fuck anyway, would they shoot you? Anyways, so I kept thinking to myself, why wouldn't they talk to me, right? But they still put the gun down and beat the horn as they were leaving. But why wouldn't they talk to me, right? So, fucking so I went digging, I went looking into it. That Porsche, right? Not that many people have a Porsche. In fact, I had an entire list of everyone who owned a Porsche in the whole city. I went to every mechanic shop. I looked on the MDW. I checked in all the records. I found almost every owner for every legal Porsche in the city. So I've come to the conclusion that it's a VIN. Right? No one on the list of Porsche owners I recognized. Not as people who would accept this. Then at one point, I actually uh, was speaking to Flair, actually. Because I don't know if you remember Flair. A long time ago, uh, I helped you out with uh, some information about some cars for some BSK people when they were robbing yeah, your uh, booth workers. From Hayes. Yeah, so I uh, I thought, okay, well, I'll ask Flair. I've helped him with this before. You know, he can probably help me out now. So I call Flair, and I'm like, hey, you know anyone who owns this Porsche? And he's like, yeah, I know a couple people. I was like, okay, who? And then he was like, yeah, I, I know one person. I was like, okay. He's like, okay, I'll call you back. Okay, he's doing a job. No worries. Two hours later, I call back. Yeah, I know a couple people. Oh, no, I, yeah, no, oh, we just I know one the person. the name of Maya. Yeah, Maya's yeah, the only person I knew. Yeah. Who's Maya? So anyway, Is they connected to us? No, just some girl I know. And I was talking to a couple of my friends outside the cafe, and they said, Oh, Ash, you know, there was a party the other night. Sana's birthday party. And I remember seeing a really fancy black Porsche there. I said, Oh, really? Who did it belong to? Who was driving it? And they said, You, right? They said me. Yep. Sana's birthday party. Mm -hmm. Where I drove a fucking Mitsubishi up to it. I don't know I wasn't there. Yeah, I drove a Mitsubishi up to it. Ah, I don't was... even know what that is. Sorry, sorry, sorry. It's the Evo. I don't yeah, know what that is. Evo. I'm pretty sure the only cars I drive around in the Mitsubishi are the EMG. Oh. Or the Lamborghini Aventador. Anyway. Shit okay, was fucking well if you don't yelling. own it then, why don't you show us a list of your cars that you own? A list and of my cars. Can, you know, see it for sure. Yeah, show us a picture of your cars owned in your phone. That way you'll prove it. Easy peasy. We'll apologize for suspecting you and we can move on. You want me to show you a list of the 20 cars I own? Yeah. I mean, since you don't own it, it shouldn't be an issue, right? I don't really see what the fucking point of that is. Well, it would And then more importantly, we would apologize more to you importantly, and day. I want to hear where the suspicion is coming from, Benji. Why do you guys think it's me? What? I just. I just spent no, 10 I, minutes I, I know you spent 10 minutes explaining, but literally nothing connected to me whatsoever. This is where I am right now. In the event that this is true, I'm not even mad. I just want to know why. Because this kind of thing, right, right? When you when you take a hit, if you took a hit, right? If you took a contract, well, that's because at the birthday party. I was seen driving a black Porsche, which, by the way, I just confirmed I wasn't. I literally drove probably Mitsubishi or the EMG. Ask other people there. You could just ask Sana or literally anyone there. There's a hundred people there. I mean, I was there too. I was. Driving. I literally the drove. The people what, who told me what were car at the they drive, Kim? I know, but you can ask any of the other hundred people what car was Raymond Romanov driving. You can anyway. clear your name by showing us the list. I, I, I want to continue very quickly. What did they do to JJ? Did they kill him? They throw him in the ocean, I'm assuming. Now, well, uh, you see, they, they didn't do, to do shit, basically. They didn't Bad do boy. anything. They didn't do anything, okay? 
I think uh, they were caught in a position where they, they might have felt like it was not worth it. Because then uh, the boys managed to post up on construction. And I think they fired a few pot shots and uh, they went away. I'm just, I'm suspicious of everybody right now, Ray. You know, and that's why I'm that just trying to clear stuff fine. up. That's why I'm trying to, that's why I'm literally sitting here clearing things up. And once again, Benji, you're my fucking friend. Why would I do this shit? That doesn't make any sense. I know exactly. That's what I've been thinking. That's what I've been saying, man. Yeah, the three people we talked to, it was an old black car. This is red and black. It doesn't matter, Ray. You know, I think we got our answers. No worries, man. I really hope I clear things up. Benji, I don't do shit like that. And you know I don't. Yeah. Yeah. I guess we just need to talk to Speedy now and we're all good. All right. Anyway. All the fucking color I always roll is this color. If you see this and you see something happen with it, please let me know and it probably is me and I feel bad. But I use the red and black for red line and for rust. All my cars, same color. The thing that I feel right now, Ray, is I trust you, you know? I've always considered you a good friend and uh, I think you know for a fact that there have been times where, you know, you needed my help, I would drop everything for you. And not just for you. But I think even back when I was a Vagos... With Speedy, you know, we, we always had this mentality that no matter what, we'd, uh, we'd back the clean boys up. If you actually got a fucking contract and you took a fucking hit out on somebody, you wouldn't be oh, too fucking... Exactly, you wouldn't be too fucking pussy to say it was you, right? No, oh, exactly, man. I fucking killed the motherfuckers. Yeah, I've got the exactly. actual hits, man. I because I myself. will fucking clap any fucking crew that decides to touch one of my boys again in the future. You know what I mean? No, I understand. I do the fucking because same I don't know what the fuck, like you know, family. like, yeah, it doesn't fucking matter what fucking crew backs them or whatever the fuck they do, right? I will put them to the fucking ground. But Ray, you know, you my bro, I trust you. You've told me the truth today, and I'm sure there will be nothing leading back to it being you ever in the future. I want you to know, I didn't take it completely as an insult. I'm sorry if I was offensive or angry whatsoever. But it's just, you don't need to understand that I'm literally dealing with conflict with GG, with CG. With my own boys fighting each other, you know what I mean? Yeah. Oh, I got a lot on my table today. That's why I was a little bit mad today. Yeah. Well, that was the guiltiest man I've ever fucking seen. Yep, time to fuck him up. I don't have to fuck anybody up, boys. Hey, you did the right move, man. I love that shit. You're putting the guilt. Don't okay. have to. Don't have to do anything, man. There. Uh, I. I after come. that, it's very clear that they were the ones that fucking did it. But, you know, I said what I wanted to say and the whole group can understand that they're fucking pussies. You know, JJ was talking about the level of respect, right? That he wanted from people, like when they try to fuck with us. Just remember what happened here today and how we called them fucking bunch of fucking pussies and they didn't do anything. And just remind JJ that, you know, you should know where you are when, uh, in this fucking food chain. You know what I'm saying? Don't, uh, don't try to make things too awkward. We will just act like normal. We do business the way we do. We don't have to give the discounts that we normally give, but uh, at some point, this is the thing, okay? It's either they step it up and Speedy or them will never, won't fuck it up and they'll just giggle about it. But, you know, if it does come up, you know, then, then it's obvious, man. It's clear already. Like, he's making it obvious who, who his friends are. And now I know that, you know, we're not, we're not that tight, so it is what it is, yeah, it right? It's good. Yeah, we don't have clear proof, but they make it so awkward. It was so defensive. It was like fucking oh. crazy right from the uh, get. I mean, the honest. first thing he did was try to blame X. I'm just, I'm yeah. waiting for him to send me yeah. the vehicle list. Like, he'll fucking sell that vehicle to fucking Flair, and then he'll send me a list of his vehicle. I guarantee yeah. fucking to you. Yeah. Fuck that, to hide it. Yeah, but anyways, guys, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna get some rest. All right, I'll see you guys later, okay? Hey, you handled it fucking perfectly, and the line you ended up there, I think... I think, Benji, you will get a phone call in a couple of days. Yeah. I really do. I really think. We'll see what happens, man. If people can fucking learn. I keep on trusting my friends, man, but my friends keep fucking me over, bro. What's up, Ray? Benji? What's up, man? I'm going to say something very clearly right now. Okay. I just had the phone call with Ash after she sent a text message to Flitter saying she's disappointed he didn't say the truth. And when Ash just said to me, What'd she say? I'm disappointed that you haven't checked yourself yet. And she hung up the fucking phone. If conflict is what you want, Benji, then conflict is what you can have. You want you, you want to you want have to sit here threaten me? Is that what you're fucking sending her to do? I don't fucking understand. You're my fucking friend. She said to me that I need to check myself because apparently I'm sitting here being okay. defensive and stupid shit about something because of, of course I'm being defensive because my friend comes to me and says I did something. 
That's why I was being defensive. She said, oh, you need to check yourself. She hangs up the phone on me when I said, why did you send a text message to Flair saying, I'm disappointed you guys for not telling us the truth or some stupid shit like that. Is your friend more than I am your friend? She's known you longer. She's the one that introduced us to each other, man. Yes, but you know how long ago that is, Benji? We are solidified as friends now. I we know, don't need someone I else know. to be I know, a cross Ray. bridge between us. And I'm telling you that. I told you how I felt about everything. And I put an end to it, right? The problem that you're having right now is, is that... Is it what Ash said to me? Yeah, is... This yes, is I'm mad at what she said. That's yeah, disrespectful. This is a problem between you and Ash. If you wanted to become a war thing, that's no problem with me! Raymond Romanov, do you want to go to war? Well, I told you, Ray, okay? Like, if you, if you want to turn it up, I'm down for it. But uh, this is up to you, man. For what, Benji? Why would that, I want to fight exactly. you? Exactly! That's what I'm saying to you right now. Ray, just fucking tell me if you fucking did it. I didn't fucking do it, Benji. I can... Wait, okay, you want me to... Benji, do you really want me to take pictures? I'll take fucking pictures of all my entire phone. You want to know why everybody thinks you're lying, Ray? Being defensive? Or what? Be because what? Because you're Some more person... defensive than a goddamn NBA MVP right now, brother. I think the, the biggest thing right now for, for me, as he said, right, is whoever took the took the contract. We just want people to tell us the truth and then we just move on from there. You know what I'm saying? And have an okay, understanding understand towards it. what's going on. Yeah, that's all it is. And I think that's just the frustration that everybody's facing right now, right? But I but think... Benji, you see where I'm trying to come from, where if someone that I consider a friend comes up to me and says to me, Ray, I think you fucking... Oh, I think you're lying about this. I think you fucking did this. And what am I supposed to be? Like, you know, they're my friend. Yeah, I understand that. And uh, the, the problem is that Ash believes a lot of the facts that were presented to her, right? And I already what facts though? I'm missing them. Yeah, no. The, what she she believes the people that were at the party that spotted you in a Porsche, man. I'm not gonna be able to convince Ash otherwise. This is a personal thing between you and her, man. Okay. If that's what she, I don't understand why she wants to do something like that. But if she wants to have an issue over nothing, then listen, listen. Uh, she all for it. If you're thinking that she's stirring shit up so that we go to war, no, that's not it. Because I already told the boys that's not fucking happening. Okay. This is a personal thing, and she just feels like you might still be lying, most likely. But you, Ray, I, you know, I, you already know. All right, Benji. Anyway, my friend, I'm sorry if I got, came across angry. I was a little bit angry at Ash. I'll just deal with that between me and her. That's okay? fine. That's fine. That's fine. You do your thing. I, uh, I will see you tomorrow, okay? Some bad motherfuckers, this is seaside hope. Too rich for you bitches, this is seaside hope.